before you see the first vlog or video log of my first ever proper match day um, I do want to say that the audio is not brilliant um, but you can hear quite a good good portion of it um, so sit back enjoy you will see me in a moment I'm going to talk about a couple of other things just to in, just to um, intersperse into the video um, but our, overall it was an interesting day hello everyone Johnny back again uh, just on my way out it's Sunday it's game it's match day going off to see Arsenal away uh, this is the first video I've ever done for an away day so it'll be interesting so really 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 nervous about the game today uh, looking forward to it though but I'm very very nervous so I will see you when I get there all right see you in a bit all right guys all right. the troublesome two some are with us you got We've got Steve here, say hello Steve. Hello. And we got we got Pokemon Ball here. Oh <laughs> Right, so Paul, first of all, how are you feeling about today? Um I don't know if it's the weather or not, or we've been back every few beers and it's a day out, but uh, I think it's quite quite important. I don't think it would be uh anything uh, special, but you know, I think yeah, I think it might be a two one or give me the draw. Yeah, I'll yeah. figure out. What about the formation? What about the formation? Well, that's the thing, we'll find out in a little while, but I'm guessing it's still probably going to be hot. Yeah, I'll see you just go out front and uh, all mount a bitch. Yeah. But, uh, you know, we will carry all game, you know, might be the same position. Here we go, Steve. Come on, mate. Come on. Uh, I would have felt better if Carson Finger hadn't announced his uh, imminent departure until tomorrow. Yeah, well, there is that. It's, it's just the football jinx, isn't it? Yeah. Every time a manager announces it's normal, even that manager will leave or he's going to leave, it's all before we start playing. I would have been up for a point, but at the moment. Yeah, I, yeah, I mean, at the end of the, end of the day, mate, it's, even though we get, we're getting a decent squad back together. I can't, I can't feel it, to be honest, feeling it at all. Still think he's going to play one up front, Arnie? Yeah. Lead the strikers on the bench again. Yeah. Play for a point, and end up losing again. That's the West Ham way, isn't it? It is, unfortunately, mate. Yeah. yeah. Right. Well, see you guys when the team sheet comes out. Well, guys, the team sheet's out. No surprise, no surprises, completely unchanged from the Stoke game. So we've got Hart in goal again. We've got Zabaleta at right wing back. Masiwaku left wing back, Creswell, Abona and Rice at centre back, Kawati and Noble in the holding midfield role, Lanzini, Joe Mario and out of it up front. So, yeah, not, not surprising in any shape or form. Steve, any thoughts on it? Oh, typical one up front who's not a striker, striker's on the bench. This is Arsenal. We all know Arsenal. Once you're attacking, you're attacking, you're attacking. They, they, they can see goals. But how can you do that when you've only got a striker up front? Okay, exactly right. I mean, at the end of the day, we, it's this is going to come out yet again saying that it's negative tactics by my boys. Um, you're absolutely right, Steve, mate. At the end of the day, it should have, it should have been more effective going out, going, 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 going home. Exactly. This, this, this is the first game since Vengers announced is um, leaving at the end of the season. This is the last London derby as well. I've checked the, I've checked the fixtures for the remainder of the season. It's not looking good. Um, I'm worried. I'm really, really worried. It should, we should have had two up front, as we said in the video before. Yeah, it is too negative. We should have had two up front. We should have had, not necessarily a negative start in, but it should have been at least a striker up front. We haven't got it. I'm not sure what's going to happen with here. So, we'll see what happens. Well, obviously, by the time everyone sees this, the game's been and gone. So, yeah, we'll see what happens. Well, we'll see you next when we get to the ground. So, as Steve has just pointed out, just too camera shy. At the end of the day, the reason why the reason why this is so negative, look, it's Karen behind the camera now. Look, 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 hello, hello. <laughs> right, he's made it. He's just made a very, very good point. That Anatovic is going to support Hernandez left, right, and centre, ball after ball after ball. This is exactly what we've been crying out for. 
as I say, it's a London derby. It's, that should have happened for today. We ain't going to see it right from the start. It's, it is going to be squeaky bum time. We're on 35 points. I think we're going to be all right with that. Maybe another point until the end of the season. 36 might be able to keep us up. But, yeah, it's, it's, not, it's, like, it's not looking good. So, see you soon. There we go. On the approach to the Emirates. Bit of real estate. Yeah, about as bad as bad as the view that we've got when we walk down. There's the, there's the clock at the top there. Yeah, but it's still at the spirit to run, they're not like us. Yeah. Down we and moved, We moved an E number. That's more than enough. <laughs> yeah. Walking down Wanker's way. Uh, but, but people don't realise that you move the knee number, that is it, your spirit's your own's gone. Exactly, mate. I agree. I mean, it's an impressive stadium, this, isn't it? It is an impressive it's stadium. Because they've done it properly. Exactly, yeah. Not that fucking two bob bit shit place we've got to go to. Nope. Well, the sun's out. Got a cloud in the sky. Hopefully the balls ain't going to be anywhere close to them. Come on, Arnie. I'm well, that makes that makes a change. There's a nice little welcome West Ham fans sign up there. They're not normally welcome here. Up the top there, look. There we go. Getting in. Fuck him. Typical. I start running the camera again, they stop singing. <laughs> oh, it's London! Oh, it's London! Here we go. Come on, Smile, you're on candy camera, son. <laughs> oh, we're on YouTube. <laughs> Fluffed it with his first, and out of it, Tom got on goal as well. The second 
for the second, but again, just no. He's not a striker, is he? That's why you need a striker up there. You've no. got three on the bench for fuck's sake. Excuse me, yeah, well, there's, there's, as I mentioned in the video earlier, there's Ginger Pele sitting in with the gravel of us as well, so that's quite good to see. Other than that, as I say, you know, we've been, we've been the dominant side for the first half. Arsenal have been terrible. Um, but, you know, nil nil at half time, we'll take that. Hopefully, something's going to be jigged in the second half. Um, and then he's been taking off injured. You can see it, yeah. 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 It'd be nice to see if I can go and grab him, but I don't think it's going to happen somehow. Um, but yeah, it's, it's been good. It's been very, very hammered up performance. It's a few few worries still, but yeah, it's, it's still near at the end of the day. then go 1-0 down a few minutes into the second half by Monreal with a very very well taken goal but unfortunately um, it shouldn't have happened but having said that a few a few moments later Anatovic jumps up with a great he header equalizes and it's 1-0 and this is the reaction <laughs> And then basically from here on out, uh, we concede three goals in seven minutes. All Joe Hart's reaction saves are wrong um, because he doesn't save. He doesn't make any saves at all. Uh, the final goal at 4-1, he puts his hand to it, but that's it. It goes into the back of the net. Two very, very well taken goals by Lacazette. Um, he's had 15 goals for Arsenal since the start of the season. Now it's ridiculous in terms of them. Bearing in mind, he's not played all that much this season. Um, and a very, very poor Aaron Ramsey cross. Um, very similar to Paul Konchesky in the FA Cup final of 2006. Um, but again, Hart doesn't come for that either. So it ends 4-1, unfortunately. Uh, we didn't deserve to lose that, as you'll see from the video coming up shortly. For, um, from our reaction to it. We didn't deserve We played well. But football's football. Right, guys, just come back from the game that's finished, Arsenal 4, well, actually, technically speaking, Joe Hart 4, West Ham 1. Post-match reaction, um, wasn't too bad, to be fair, we, you know, we, we didn't deserve to lose it, we, we definitely deserved to get a draw out of that. There's, there's, there's not really much to say, to be honest with you. Paulie, what are your thoughts on get off Pokemon for a few minutes? Um... Well, first, you know, most, most, of the, most of the game, we, we were equal to them. Yeah. We were equal to them, you know, we had each other, both of us had our chances. Just what happened, what happened in the last, last section of the game, it's just like we fell apart. Mm. It's, you know, just, not just heart, it's just the defence, just everything really. It just, we, I don't see why we, you know, we could have kept up with doing it. And, in the first bit of the game, we was equal to them. Just we do we do this regularly. It's, it's not 
something wrong there. Something wrong there. Like we keep losing games. Um, three goals in that match of time. It's just not right. It's just, I don't know. I mean that 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 is the what that is the worrying thing. Where when it went in, as you'll see from the halftime video, at one all, um, and we won all for most of the game, and then the last seven minutes conceded three goals in, in that time. It was just it was awful to watch. Um, most of it, to be fair, as I say, it was mostly down to Hart's positioning and inability to grab the ball. Um, but what I want to say, as I echoed it in my um, video about Wenger that I put up yesterday, the, the Arsenal support was a fucking arsehole. So they really are. There was nothing when, apart from apart from when, um, apart from when, what was his name? Mon, 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 apart from Mon, Monreal's goal, there was absolutely nothing until two one. And as Steve has just said here now, it was they was they were up up singing. So two one up and that was it. They were singing and that was and we just capitulated. I mean, in the in the first half we had, we had some good chances. We could have easily been up to Fernandez had it absolutely laid on the plate down with his foot. Um, and Netovic for the second one, but I think we had the second second chance. Um, but you know, to be to be fair though, Monreal's goal was taken well. It should never have happened. It was a it was a goalkeeping error. It's a defensive error. Um, which should never have happened. Um, and then where else are we? So we had two from Lacazette. Again, two good goals, but Hart could have could have done better with it. And Aaron, yeah, and Aaron Ramsey is basically just a, nothing more than a pass. That we all we all know what it's like to see a goal going from a pass. We, you know, we've been on the we've been on the end of them, and we've scored a few of them in our time and all. But Stevie, your thoughts on the game? Well, should have been two up at half time. Easy. If we'd had a striker up front, maybe we would have been to at half time. You know, what happens when Arnie, Arnie has a strike partner with him? Bring on from Hernandez. I mean, that, that, well, is, a, that, is, a, that is a very, very one good one. point. That is a very, Simple very good point. Simple as. Yeah. Alright, both of them when they're together don't backtrack, but what do you know? Hernandez isn't a defender. If you want to defend it and defend, you bring on Carroll. Yeah. But the point of the thing is, Seven minutes to go, one one, draw all over it, quite happy, same as Chelsea, two London Derbys, walk away with two points, that is Larry. Then all of a sudden Joe Hart, bang, bang, bang. Seven minutes all over. Yeah. Disgusting. I mean with with the with the fourth goal, that is the worst out of the four in my opinion that Hart Hart's mistake. Because he had, he, he touched the ball and went into the back of the net off his off his hand. In my opinion, if you've if you got enough time to grab the ball doing the, the Superman save, then you've got enough time to put both hands on the ball to grab it. Um, if we, as I say, we did, we did not deserve it, um, but it's just... It's one, just one, one would have been a fair result. Yeah. You know? But what do you do? Why, why does Moyes insist on having no strikers up front? End of. He used to say, every week's the same. Bring on an Andes, and Andes and all, and all to it. Do the business together. I mean, the, the, the entire game changed when when Mario came off for um, Hernandez and uh, who else is it? Uh, Fernandez, Fernandez came, came, off. came off for um, oh, Lanzini. Yeah. So yeah, the game totally changed from there. I mean, to be honest with you, I, I don't mind Mario. But I don't mind Mario at all. But you, 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 what do you do? You take off Mario for Lanzini, they both can't play together, so that was fair enough. But is Lanzini as good as they say he is? I don't know. I mean, just going, going on going on the match performances, I mean, Hart, we've already spoken about. Masuaku had a good game. Zabaleta had a good game. Um, Declan Rice, for me, was the absolute man of the match as far as I'm concerned, was the one of the best players out there. Very mature for his age. Yeah. Very mature. Top of defender. Um, who else was it? So Obono wasn't didn't do too bad either. Creswell was up for the fight quite a lot. I mean, this this is the annoying thing. With the exception of Hart and Goal, I can't think of anyone that had a bad performance. Steve, any no. anyone you think no. that had a bad? No, 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 it changed when, when, when an end is came on, but that's just my opinion. You should have started with two up front. You could have been two up at half time, but there again, that's down to the manager. But no, I think I think Art was awful at the end. Should have been one one. Arsenal fans, useless shit, waste of space. Give it all bitty big bollocks when they're two up. I mean, think start I'll start singing. There's only one Arsenal thing that have been handing out for two seasons. And now he's retired, they're singing his name. 
I mean, thinking about, it, I think the only person that had a mediocre performance was Fernandez. He was he was worrying for a lot of things. Paulie, what about you? What did you think about the field? Who do you think was um, any bad performances or good performances that stood out for you? Just a general lack of lack of um, confidence at, at the back, letting the Arsenal, let the Arsenal players come through. Um, um, announced it was, was, was good. He was good. He had his moments. Uh, Great goal as well. Yeah, but he's let down by you know they sort of they keep it up. They keep up that. Um, I don't know it was one, it was one all for a while, for a while. So they kicked that up, they kicked that up, and they just, you know, I don't know what, what to say really, they just, they just, they just seem to let, let it go. Yeah, I mean, that is that is the worrying thing that as, as West Ham supporters we've seen day in, week in, week out for donkey's years. It's the fact that you could you could say to a degree there was some there was some tired legs out there, but I'd be very surprised if anyone used that argument. You never see a game there, do you? No. This is, this is the thing, we, we will always lose a game in the last few minutes. We've been doing it time and time again. It's, it, was, it's a, it, was, it, was, um, it was a shock to see that at the that Hearts in goal. I'm very glad, like everyone else seems to be, that Adrian's going to be in goal for the, for the City yeah. game because at the end of the day, obviously, Hart. But does that mean that we're not going to concede the same amount of goals? We'll, well, we'll find out in a couple of weeks. I really don't want to sign him up next year. <laughs> you mean? Yeah. I think the biggest mistake is getting rid of Randolph. Perfect number mm -hmm. two. Yeah, I mean the, the, the problem the problem with Randolph was the fact that he want, he wanted he wanted a lot more regular football, so he, he had no choice but to go. I mean, he felt like he was being pushed out, especially with Hart coming in. So yeah, it was a bad move in that sense. But as I say, guys, it was just it's awful. So, but we move on. We got Leicester away next, um, which I think is going to be probably a harder probably a harder game than we than we played out today. To be honest with you, I mean Arsenal were terrible. They were. Shocking, you know, there was not the Arsenal in any shape or form. You know, as we're, as we're saying, we were one all for nil nil at half time, one all for, for up to the 83rd minute, and then just capitulated as we always do. The thing is, we've got Man City next week, you know what's going to happen, and then we've got Leicester away, that, that's going to be an odd game, and then we've got Man United, what's going to happen there? They always beat us, and then Everton, Everton always beat us, so let's give. We, we might not get nothing out for the rest of the season. That could be, be the season end and all. For me personally, the, the highlight—the highlight of the game was was knowing that Ginger, Ginger Pele was in the in the crowd with us. I mean, it, as I, I mean, the Dec, him and Declan Rice, as I say, Rice was absolutely outstanding. I mean, it was a great goal by Naljovic. Um, great little, great little header. As I said at half time. Other than that, that's it. So. So yeah, we move on, move on to the next game, so we've got City at home next, and that's about it, that's all we can really talk about, I and mean, there's, there's not many, there was, there was not many talking points to talk about, so thanks for watching guys, um, if you're new around here, please click the like button if you've liked the video, and please hit the subscribe button, because um, it'd be nice to get up to 30 subscribers, but in the meantime, we go again next weekend, all the best, bye bye.